It's all smoky. <clears throat> I believe it's still from the uh, uh, Canadian Fire. I haven't heard much about uh, <clears throat> the uh, 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 California having a fire. So. happen, you know, we definitely hear about it. I'm still, uh, still kind of surprised they haven't been able to figure out exactly what started the fire, or fires in Canada. And of course people are shooting out fireworks before Independence Day, because, well, that's how, uh, things go around here. But uh, yeah, this is uh, quite something. During the day, it looks pretty good, but as the night falls, you know, it's quite interesting, to say the least. Well, people are fine, you know, in the areas where the fires are. Stuff like that is always unfortunate. But, unfortunately, it does happen. And I know in California, for sure. Because uh, this has basically been said to have been a, a big reason with the brush. You know, they all started like as brush fires, primarily in California. You know, if they clean up the brush, over there, and like the various sticks and stuff, where all the fires primarily take place, you know, um, then a lot of the uh, fires wouldn't happen. Or if they would, they would at least be a little more contained. Uh, but a lot of people are lazy. You know? I guess some people are like, it's not my job to uh, pick up stuff, so why should I even bother? And yeah, I'm sure some of those people are also uh, very much for the environment, and yet they s probably do the bare minimum to try and show they really care about the environment. Like, uh, they recycle more than the average person on their, uh, or in their neighborhood. <clears throat> so there you go, that's how they care for the environment, more than everybody else that lives on their street or apartment building or what have you um, but it, it's interesting so this just stay safe and I hope you're all doing well